Yes, Overwatch is out now on store shelves, but is it worth your time? My name is Jordan and you're watching Replay. Conflict. As the world teetered on the brink of anarchy, a new hope arose. So for those of you who don't know, Overwatch is a team shooter set in a stunning universe that is way cooler than ours. You play in teams of six, choosing from a massive roster of over 20 characters. While you do have complete freedom as to which character and class you play, it is important to choose wisely and do what is best to benefit your team. All game types encourage team play, making it important to work together. The two main game types are payload and point capture. Payload has you following a moving objective, attacking players must escort the objective from point A to point B, while the defending team tries to prevent this from happening. Point capture centers around two points on the map, the attacking team must capture these points pushing back the defending team. Getting back to the class system, Overwatch has offense, defense, tank and support classes. Offense characters operate independently, they move fast and hit hard, giving them good opportunity to pick players off one by one. The drawback is their lower health, which makes them easier to eliminate. The characters in the offense class are Genji, McCree, Farah, Reaper, Soldier 76, and Tracer. Defensive characters can hit harder, but aren't as fast. They can set up traps, secure areas, and stop the push of the other team. The defense characters are Bastion, Hanzo, Junkrat, Mei, Torbjorn, and Widowmaker. The support class helps out using healing abilities, stat boosts, and disabling enemies. Supports don't do too much damage, but can have a huge impact on the game that can heal tanks or cripple the enemy. The current support characters are Lucio, Mercy, Symmetra, and Zenyatta, I think, yeah? The tank class is, as you would expect, a tank. They have the most health and skills that allow them to protect themselves from their allies. The main function is to soak up damage while the offense characters flank the distracted enemies. The tank characters are Diva, Reinhardt, Roadhog, Winston, and Zara. <laughs> Zara. Overwatch is a team-based game, so be smart when choosing your character. It's best to try and have at least one support and one tank to balance out your team. Get to know the characters and their skill sets and your team will become the masters of Overwatch. So, should you buy it? Well, that's up to you. I know I sure as hell am. Though, if you're more of a solo running gun kind of guy, this game probably isn't for you. While it is possible to do that, you will not get the same satisfaction you get out of games like Call of Duty or Halo playing it in that style. This is a team game that can only be won by cooperation. So will you be getting Overwatch? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in to Replay. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more from us, check out our Facebook and Twitter. And of course, like and subscribe. <laughs> You're gonna do it again, aren't you? Just watch it scroll away. Oh, someone's here.